Today we're going to talk about uh, a great exercise to help stabilize people's shoulder blades that often aren't moving properly for all sorts of reasons. One of the most common postures we will see and you will probably see is you'll see this rounded shoulder posture. Our whole world seems to be down in front of us and especially over the past year everything's really been down in front of us um, and so what's important here is this posture over time creates tightness in the front of your body and it starts to crowd your shoulders and ultimately you start to experience a lot of neck pain mid back pain and even shoulder pain from chronic postural strain so one of the exercises I like to give patients to stabilize their shoulder blades or their scapulae is involving a little bit of a weight. Now we've got a six kilogram uh, kettlebell here, so this is pretty darn heavy. I wouldn't recommend anyone start with six uh, kilograms. That's about 15-ish pounds, so that's a lot. So I would recommend starting with either nothing, with your hands just uh, working against gravity, or a couple of pounds and work your way up. So uh, Kevin here is gonna be our, our model for this particular exercise. So the goal is to try to convince his shoulder blades to come back and down as if there were was a magnet right here and the lower corners of his shoulder blades were being lightly pulled to this area. Now right now, I would say this is almost exaggerated. So I want you to relax a little bit and then just lightly pinch towards here, good. So right about there is where I wanna see those shoulder blades, okay? So now have you turn and face me, and legs shoulder width apart, and just try to tuck your pelvis underneath you there. Imagine a bowl of water in your pelvis, and I don't want any water to be spilling out the front of the bowl or the back of that bowl, nice and neutral. Pretty anchored to the ground, and then with straight arms out in front of you to shoulder height, Full bear, and then try to just lightly pinch your shoulder blades together. Good. And hold in that position till you feel like you fatigue. And some signs of fatigue here, so shaking, shoulders want to roll forward, you collapse in your low back. Okay, and then one other variation of this theme is to actually try to stabilize your shoulders and your shoulder blades while you're moving your neck. So I'll have you do it one more time. Again, neutral pelvis, raise your arms up, good and hold there. Yep, light contraction, holding those shoulder blades and now just turn your head as far as you can on one side and then the other. Come back, tip your head back, good, chin to your chest. Good, look straight ahead, tip one ear to one shoulder, and then other ear there. Great, awesome, scapular stabilization. Mm -hmm. <laughs>